Hi, my name is Steve Cordero from Acrobat Enterprise Support. Welcome to IT Tips and Tricks. How do AIP deployments work with version 9? First of all, AIP stands for Administrative Installation Point. Simply put, it's creating an all-in-one installation package utilizing single or multiple updates so that there are only one installation that occurs. For Adobe Acrobat 9 and Adobe Reader 9, this can be a complicated task because there's a specific logical order that needs to be followed. The logical order is best described as use only quarterly updates unless the last update is an out of order security update. For Adobe Reader, this is a bit simpler because full installers are periodically created for quarterly updates, so there won't be a long list of updates as there is with Adobe Acrobat. However, Adobe does provide an installation order with the KBs. CPS ID 49880, Update, Patch, Acrobat Reader 7X through 9X Windows. There's also invaluable information contained with the Enterprise Administration Guide, which can be found in KB CPS ID underscore 83709, titled Enterprise Administration, Acrobat Family of Products. The Go URL is www.adobe.com forward slash go forward slash Acrobat IT Info. The current order of installation for Adobe Reader 9 is as follows. 9.4.0 to 9.4.2 to 9.4.5 to 9.4.6 to 9.4.7 Our first piece of business is to copy the MSI file and the updates to a local folder on your hard drive. I've already done this and put it in a file folder that I call flat files. Next, you open up the command prompt. And navigate to that folder. Next, you need to run the administrative installation from the command prompt with the following command msi exec exe space forward slash a and then the name of the msi file you're using and hit return Note the welcome setup is for Adobe Reader 940. Hit next. And it's asking for a network location. In this case, we're going to use a local directory on the hard drive. And we're going to put it in a folder called 9.4.0. Click OK. And then begin the install. Setup complete, click finish. Let's have a look at the 9.4.0 folder and see what it looks like. As you can see, the MSI file is there and also reciprocal folders to the OS where the reader installation files are placed. Now let's copy that folder. As soon as the copy is done, rename the folder. And in this case, we're going to rename it to the update that we're going to use, which is 9.4.2. Go into your flat files folder and copy the update file. And then place it in the 9.4.2 folder.
and copy the path to the 942 folder. Go to the command prompt and change directories into that folder. Now we're ready to update those files to 9.4.2 and we do so again using the administrative installation command. MSI exec.exe space forward slash a the name of the MSI file that you're using and the name of the update file after the forward slash b or patch. and then press return. Again, the welcome screen to 9.4.2, click next. The location has already been set to the folder we're running the installation from. Click install. Setup complete, click finish. navigate back to the EIP folder and copy the 9.4.2 folder then rename the folder to 9.4 Copy the update file for 9.4.5 and place it in the 9.4.5 folder. Copy that path and then change directories in the command prompt to the 9.4.5 folder. And then again, we're going to type the command to run the administrative installation and then the patch. and then hit return. The welcome screen says setup for Adobe Reader 9.4.5. Click next. Again, the location has been set for the directory we are running in. Click install. Setup complete. Finish. Go back to the AIP directory and copy the 9.4.5 directory. Rename that directory after it's copied. 9.4.6 copy the appropriate update file for 9.4.6 
and place it in the 9.4.6 folder. Copy the path from the 9.4.6 folder and then use it to change directories in the command prompt. Then again run the administrative install for updating to 9.4.6. MSI exec space forward slash A, the name of the MSI file you're using. Space forward slash p and the name of the update file that you're using. And then hit the return key. Welcome to setup for Adobe Reader 9.4.6. Click the next button. Again, the path is already selected for us from the path we're running the installation from. Click install. Setup complete. Click finish. And you now have an administrative installation point for Adobe Reader 9.4.6. That ends this session. And don't forget to get the IT newsletter at www.tipsandtricksforit.com.